Hey, what is up everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Card Openings. And in today's episode, we are repping the spooky. It is spooky season. I'm so excited. We got some spooky stuff going on here. We got a little Pokeball Halloween. Uh, Pokeball Jack Lantern Halloween themed. We got another one. These are handmade. Uh, me and my girlfriend like to do like little arts and crafts every year. Uh, so I have a couple of these now. It's becoming a little tradition of mine to do Pokemon themed. So this is a Pokemon themed little jack-o'-lantern um, with a Shinx instead of a cat. They're, I'm super proud of this one. I love that. And then uh, I also got a little my first figurine it's actually you know spoopy themed with grimer there's a lamp in there you can't really see too well um and a ghastly uh, and haunter kind of graffiti down the wall it is super cool i love the fact that the, the little lamp it moves uh so those are going to be in the background today um and i'm super excited because we are getting into the <laughs> newest set in Pokemon cards is the Trick or Trade Booster Bundle. So I'm very excited. I have no idea what's in here. All I know is that there is spooky themed. Uh, it comes with 40 packs, which is crazy. Oh, wow. It's just... Oh, yeah. All the goodies. All the goodies. Let's go. Yo, ho, ho. <laughs> these are actually so cool. Um, let's freaking go. Let's just rip into them. And, uh, oh, 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 gosh. All right, I retrieved the ones that fell. I'm not prepared for 40 packs. <laughs> but let's just get into it. I, I imagine that these are going to be pretty easy to open up. And uh, let's go ahead and see what's inside. All right, so changing... One of the light settings here. And let's just get into card openings. Let's see. Nothing in there, no. Nothing. And ooh, we start off with the hollow. Okay. So it starts off with the hollow. I know there's 30 cards. There are 30 unique cards in this set. Very cool. And each one of them has this little Pikachu. The hollow one is actually a hollow Pikachu, and then the rest are more like that. Very cool. And Poltegeist. So I'm gonna try and complete the set in uh, one booster bundle. And, uh, you know, just kind of a break from the Pokemon Go series as we have just. One from the back. And we get a Poltegeist. Oh! Is it two from the back? I guess two from the back. I don't know. <laughs> Another Dust Noir and a Spinarak. So I'm going to kind of keep all my singles over here and doubles over here. I feel like we're going to get a lot of doubles, despite only having three cards for back. So maybe it's like I got to flip the front card around to the back. Oh, we got Pikachu. This is like the one like non-spooky card because you gotta get Pikachu in here, right? Pikachu. Oh, we got a little Nicket. And ooh, Gorgeis Hollow card. Nice. And again, I have no clue <laughs> what's in these. Um, I, I'm hoping that Phantom is in here. I can guess that your boy Mimikyu is in here. Oh. All right. Oh, we got Cubone. Cubone's in the set. Oh, Cubone. <laughs> uh, Duskull, okay. And Hatterene. Hatterene's in the set? Hatterene is spooky? I mean, I guess it's a witch. Or like, witch, witchy. That's cool. Um, don't know if like everything has like a hollow version or not. I don't think. But uh, it seems like there is one guaranteed hollow card per pack. Which is dope, you know, the trick or treat kind of like everyone wins kind of an aspect to it. Bruh, this is why I always snip off the tops. Maybe I might take a little break real quick to just snip off all these tops because it is it's hard out here. Hatterene. 
Oh, that's a new one. Mischievous. Hey, and Mimikyu is a holo card in this set. That is super dope. Let's freaking go. Um, all right. I'm trying not to get, like, peeks at anything. Okay, Spinarak is a double. I don't think we got Gaston yet. Gengar! <laughs> Let's go. Love me some Gengar. Let's go. Um, but anyways, like I was saying, I hope Phantom's in this. Phantom is... Gosh. I guess Alone Marowak is probably my favorite Ghost-type Pokemon. But uh, Phantom and Trevenant definitely have to be in that, like, discussion. Okay, Zubat's a double up. Poltegeist is a double up. Darkrai! Let's go! Darkrai's in the set. You know what? That makes sense. Darkrai is the ultimate, like, edgelord spooky Pokemon. So, very cool, very cool. Yeah. I feel like Giratina needs to be in this. I don't know if it is or not. Like, I feel like there's a lot of ghost type Pokemon. Wait, how's it? Front one goes in the back. Okay. Hatterene. Nick. It. Oh, it's a grass type. Trevenant as a hollow card. Let's go. My boy. Seed Bomb Shadow Cage. That's kind of dope. Again, I have no clue. I got actually two booster bundles because they, they are an absolute steal. Um, I think it's like 15 bucks or something for like 40 packs and I had no clue I was just like oh booster bundle bet gotta do that my girlfriend told me where to find some and it's like all right gotta go get him Mimikyu hey that's a double up there um yeah I don't know maybe I'll donate it to uh my local card shop that I get most of my cards from um because I have literally a whole other case, but like, I was kind of expecting to, um, I mean, I already saw it, but Litwick, okay, that's new. Dusclops is new. And then Gengar, holo card. Yeah, you know, I think, because my local place I usually get my cards from is actually having like a, like a Halloween, like drive, um, one day. So I think I might just go ahead and give them this. Just like I've gotten so much from them, I might as well give a little back. Because I have a whole other thing, and we still have all these, all these packs. So I think I might do that. Can't be peeking. Oh, Sinisi, that's new. And then double up on the Trevenant card. Yeah, you know, yeah, it's definitely very easy to complete this set. I feel like we already have like a whole lot. I don't know. I'm gonna have to double check and go through all everything. And I even got like a little, little binder that literally fits like 30 cards. So there's 30 cards in this set, so it should fit exactly the set. Also, this light setting, oof, very bright. One from the back. Pikachu, Nicket, and Gorgeist. Very cool. I feel like this is going to be me with my next Pokemon Go opening. And Ooh, Lampin? I don't think I got Lampin yet. No, I got Litwick. Ooh, Murkrow. That's dope. And Dust Noir. Hey, we're like halfway through, maybe. Hello? One from the back. And. Ooh, Ariados. Very cool. Sinistry. And double up on the Gorgeist. Very cool. I don't know what I'm going to do with all these double ups either. Either keep them for my own collection um, of like random things that I have. Or maybe, I don't know, trade them or do something. Cubo, no. Dusko, and ooh. Yo, that Miss Magius is actually kind of dope. That's kind of sick. Kind of like that. Let's go. All right, that's a new one. Okay. I don't know. 
we're like this deep and we're still finding some new ones so i don't think we found haunter we've had ghastly and gank gar um all right that was very cool mischievous dust noir that might be my first mischievous I'm not sure I just like, I, I like the fact that, like, Pokemon knows that it's like, hey, a lot of people like Pokemon and like Halloween, and it's kind of adding the two things together just makes sense. Phantom! Let's go. I think that's my first Phantom. Ghastly. Oh. <laughs> Mewtwo is in this set? What? Bro. Bro. Yo. And you two would be looking hella dope. Oh my gosh. That's insane. That's insane card art. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, <laughs> anyways, I, I think Pokemon just kind of knows. Like, it's the one of the biggest, if not the biggest, like, franchise in the world. And, um... At that point, you kind of... Oh, there's the hunter. Let's go. Um, you kind of got to like know your audience at that point and be like, hmm, a lot of people like the spooky, a lot of people like the Pokemon. Combine the spooky with the Pokemon and bada-bing, bada-boom. I mean, every year there's tons of like Pokemon like merch that's Halloween-related or like spooky-related, etc. I mean, shoot, Gengar is like top five most popular Pokemon Murkrow and Darkrai the ultimate edgelord let's go very cool and I feel like this this is going slower only because it's taking so long to get through all these I did not know that like trimming the tops of everything literally made my life so much easier Litwick Pumpkaboo hey that's a new one and Miss Magius again. Very cool. Love that card art. I think we still need Chandelure. I don't think we've gotten a Chandelure yet. That might be the only thing that we're missing. I don't know. But we got Gore Guys. We got Pumpkaboo. We got Trump Trevenant. We got Phantom. Got the Ghastly line. Duskops line. I think we might need Hatina. Hatina and Chandelure. Just assuming that everything has uh, its evolved form and the entire line. I'm gonna have to Google what's in this set after and just double check. Aridos, Mischievous, and Mimikyu. I actually love the card arts. Like the card arts are really good. Like, I know that these are all, like, reused from uh, Sword and Shield sh sets and just kind of, they took the best card arts with the spookiest designs and were like, all right, you're going to become a set all through your own. And just stamped the uh, pumpkin Pikachu on there. But uh, let's see what we get. I actually, I love the card arts. The card arts are so good. And there's such, like, a mix of, like, the more realistic ones to the more cartoony ones. Um, I think that's one thing that kind of, like, sets Pokemon cards apart. Is, like, there's so many different ways to draw and to animate different Pokemon. Like, from the ones that are, like, ooh, Hatchrum. That's literally the one that I was talking about. Poltegeist. And Miss Magius. From like uh, Pokemon cards that are like really stat like cartoony to um, Pokemon cards that are more like realistic, like this Pumpkaboo. Like it's just so so cool, so neat to like see the different card arts. And of course, just the the feeling of uh, getting a new card. Oh, so good. Like, I'm, what, 28 years old, and look at how much joy I'm getting from this. <laughs> this is great. It's fantastic. A complete double up right there. All double ups, but very cool. 
Um, honestly, I could maybe give some of these to my baby sister. She doesn't really, she loves Pokemon. Doesn't really appreciate or know, like, she's younger, like, way younger. Uh, so I don't know if she'd appreciate Pokemon cards, but she loves Pokemon. I don't know. Maybe I'll give her some of the double ups. Some of the shiny ones at least. Um, since she'd be like, ooh, shiny. Not, you know, literally like shiny, like shiny Pokemon, like shiny because it's a hollow card, you know. Phantom. Every Phantom is a good Phantom. And a double up on the Mewtwo. Mewtwo looking so good there. Oh my god. Love Mewtwo. Love me some Mewtwo. The full art Mewtwo for the Pokemon Go um, set, I'm still looking for. I'm so surprised I haven't actually got it. But the way like other people like double up on it when they're trying to complete the set. Like I know Unless Leaf pulled so many that it, it actually ridiculous amounts of uh, full art like in the in the city Mewtwo, like Times Square Mewtwo. Hello. Yo, I think we're we're actually coming down towards the end. Uh, you know, I don't think I've seen Thievil in this either. I saw Nicket, but I don't think I've seen Thievil, and we haven't seen uh, Chandelure. I don't know if they're in the set even. I don't even know if I've pulled 30 unique cards or not. Um, she's completely opening this blind. And you know what? We might not be able to get the whole set today but i think i am we might not get the whole set today but i think i'm going to uh no matter what i'm just going to go ahead and uh donate that other uh trigger treat set and then i don't know do like uh they have trading open so i might trade for uh whatever i don't have but i'm feeling really generous and i really want to uh go ahead and donate that to my local card shop. I don't know if they take donations. I know they have people sell cards to them because they have cards, like single cards for sale. So I'm assuming those were, you know, sold and not, you know, just given. Because there'd be some cards there worth like a hundred dollars, or at least they're being sold for a hundred dollars. Zubat, Pulti Ice, Hattering. So I'm assuming there's an exchange of money for them. They really make those uh, hard to get into. Zubat, Duskull, and another Mewtwo. Very cool, very cool. We have one, two, three. Good, good, little, good little handful. So I realized, oh, didn't do the card trick. <laughs> I realized that sometimes there's just gonna be dead air and I think I'm just gonna cut that out of the video. Because sometimes, who wants to just listen to dead air, you know? All right, let's uh, remember to do the card trick this time. Hatterene, Sinisty, hey, Chandelure. Chandelure, and it's a holo card, and my camera just died. All right, we're back up, and uh, we've pulled the Chandelure, which is super cool. Camera battery died right as I was pulling that. Um, and before that, I was saying I might be cut doing a lot of editing just to cut out the dead space in between pack openings. But uh, wow, that is is very nice, very cool. And I like how they're not all like the psychic energy like type Pokemon, so it's not like all purple, um, which we'll see when we eventually open up and hopefully complete the full set. Um, There'll be some purples, there'll be like the Pikachu yellow, Cubone is in there, um, with the like earth energy, uh, and then we have the Chandelure, Litwick line, uh, with the fire energy, so, and then Phantom, and Trevenant, uh, for the grass type energy, which is super cool. I think that's really dope. And we got a Spinarak here, Sinistee, and Dust Noir. I think that might be everything. I'll cut towards the end. All right, so I just realized that camera two was not recording. Um, 
But basically, I showed off the Chandelure there, um, and then I finished up uh, the rest of the card packs, and I don't think that there is actually anything that we are missing. Nothing, uh, we didn't pull anything new from the last couple packs, so I just kind of breezed through the last, like, five packs there. And we're going to count out. There should be 30 as we do a little bit of a review. So, one, a two, a three, a four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, did we get the 16 already? I don't think so. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, uh, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Did I have two of something? I got two hat traps. Okay, cool. That is the whole set, which is super cool. I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve this everything up, and I'm gonna show you them in a like in a binder. All right, so we have gone ahead and sleeved up everything, and like I said, it's a literal mini binder. <laughs> um, let's freaking go! I, I'm so excited about this. This is really cool. I think like looking at a whole set, and like yeah, it, it's it's mini, but it's it's super cool to be able to be like. Hey, I got a whole set of cards completed. I think it's really cool. And being able to see everything like all together is uh, really cool, you know? And like, uh, I don't know, it's just, there's just something really cool about this. This is my first ever completed set. And yeah, it, it's a mini set. But um, it's really cool. I like it. Yo, know, this this double page right here, this this is probably my favorite page right here. Is uh, Phantom Trevenant. That's really cool. And just going through and being like, you know what? I finished a set. This this feels nice. This definitely uh is also very cool because it's not like the same set that we've been doing for well over a month now with the uh, Pokemon Go set, which. Don't get me wrong, I love the Pokemon Go set. But, uh, it's just really cool. Uh, and, like I said, I do have other sets and things that I can open up. Um, but, I also have another one of these guys. And a couple other little things which will complete, officially complete the Pokemon Go. Like, I. I will have opened up every Pokemon Go product during the next video. But, that's going to be it for today's episode. Spooky season is here. I'm super excited. And we just finished the whole trick or trade spooky bundle. Or booster bundle. <laughs> Anyways, if you did like it, go ahead and smash the thumbs up button. If you enjoyed the series, please subscribe. And, as always, God bless, and see you for another episode of Pokemon Cardo. See you.